beginners. So this video is just for cellos. If you are a violin or a viola, please go ahead and click on the regular page 21. If you're a cello, you can stay here because we're going to be doing something brand new today. On page 21, you're going to see a lot of things that are labeled fourth finger. We as cellos have already been using our fourth finger for the entire year to play things like D on the A string and G on the D string. Instead of adding a pinky finger, since we already use it, today we're going to be working on something called shifting. Shifting is where you take your fingers and move them to another spot on the cello, okay? Usually our first finger is on our first finger tape. Today we're going to be shifting onto another tape. When we shift, we want to make sure that our thumb comes with us so that it's comfortable. As we slide, we're going to bring our thumb with us. It would be uncomfortable to slide just your first finger, leaving your thumb down. So today, you can see on my cello, I've got my first finger tape and my third finger tape. That's where we're going to be shifting to. So go ahead and put your first finger on the A string with your thumb behind it, and we're going to shift up to the C sharp tape. We're going to bring our first finger and thumb with us. Make sure that you lift up so that you're not pressing down on your cello when you slide. Here we go and shift up, shift down, shift up, shift down. Make sure your thumb follows you every time. Shift up, shift down. Now let's try it using our bow on our cello to see if we can play and shift at the same time. Starting on the A string, go ahead and play the note B. Shift to that C sharp tape, shift back down to B. Shift up to C sharp. Now let's go ahead and try that on the D string. First finger down on your first finger tape makes the note E. Shift up to first finger or to the third finger tape for an F sharp. Shift down for E. Shift up for F sharp. Now go ahead and stay there because we're going to put some more fingers down in the shifted position. This is going to break the pattern that we're used to. One, three, four because in our shifted position today, we're gonna to be playing one, two, four. Go ahead, play F sharp with your first finger. Put your second finger down on the G tape. And now put fingers three and four down to create the note A. F sharp, G, A. Let's try it again. F sharp, two fingers for G, four fingers for A. Ready, go. F sharp, G. A. Again. F sharp. G. A. Again. F sharp. G. And you'll notice I said that this note with all four fingers in shifted position was an A. It's the exact same A that we get when we play an open. Do you hear how they sound the same? This is just another way to play A, and it's a way that we're going to be using on page 21. Go ahead and click on the next video for the beginning of page 21 where we actually use this shifting technique. See you on the next video.